charismatic person. And once she was uh, in the last couple of weeks of her life, we kind of all knew it and we gathered around her in the hospital and she just kind of had the time of her life. If anyone had a beautiful death, she did. She always loved to party. And uh, she told the doctors now that everybody was there, she didn't want to go, so um, she, she didn't for a while. She called each of us up to her bedside and um, she, she called me up and she said, well now I want you to sing at my funeral. And I said, yes ma'am. And she said, I want you to write me a song. And I said, I will try my best. And she said, and I want it to be as good or better than the one you wrote for your pebble. <laughs> so, <laughs> I, I wrote this for both of them. They loved each other very much in a very sort of cantankerous, wonderful way. And I'm sure they're up there somewhere fighting over the remote. As we <laughs> sit there. So, so we're going to... So this is the last one on my record. Um, we started with the first one, so we thought we'd end with the last one. I'll make it through. I'll make it through to the other side with help from you. With help from you, my darling, who waits there for me on the golden shores, on the golden shores of eternity? Take my hand, oh, take my hand and lead me there. With your dear love, with your dear love, where we will live, no more to die. But gratefully, oh gratefully, this world of loneliness below. This world without, this world without, I'm glad to go. Make it through, I'll make it through to the other side. With help from you, with help from you, my darling, who? 